up uh, the flash mob, Kaylee. What the, come on, tell the people. What, what? It had just been a dream of mine to do a flash mob, and I said, guess what? You're all doing it with me. Um, just got the crew. I had this idea for many moons, many years, many seasons. I thought, gosh, it'd be so awesome. So I kind of asked around the crew if they'd be interested, and they were like, oh my God, that would be so fun. So I kind of told the cast, like kind of, yeah, I did tell them we're doing this. <laughs> And I, I said, I want to surprise the writers. We'll do it in front of a live taping. I didn't know how we are going to pull this off, but my sister happens to be an incredible dancer and choreographer. So I called her. I'm like, OK, I have this idea. I want to do a flash mob with our entire crew in front of a taping in like two weeks. Um, here are the songs. I sent her six songs because I wanted it to be really long. And I'm like, do you think you can put this together? She called me back in 30 minutes. She goes, I have it. And put herself on her phone to show me. And I'm like, you don't have it. She did the whole thing. She had done the whole thing and came the next day and our crew took a long lunch and we learned it and the guys and the girls, we all learned it and, and we did it and it was the best moment of my life. <laughs> and we didn't tell anyone, we didn't tell the writers. It was funny because it was the end of a, t a show. So the show had wrapped but we all went into the living room set and the writers were like, everyone's like, we didn't write another scene. You know, we're sitting in there like ready to go. And um, then the music started and, oh, it's magic. It's pretty yeah. amazing. Yeah, you guys it is are, the best thing and, I've ever you done. You got some good moves, uh, Melissa over there. Uh, yeah. Oh, yes, but am I right? Or oh my wrong? God. Yeah. Literally. That Jim Parsons stood in the background. Yeah. He, to his defense, he didn't get a lot of time to learn it. He was very busy that week, and so I'm like, well. did you dance a little? Well. From where? Kimmy didn't want to yeah. learn it. I can't. He didn't want. To. Kaylee was very kind. And but said, I said, you got to be in this. You here's the do. deal. <laughs> Would you please just stand there <laughs> and watch us? And when the whole thing's over, just go, bazinga. Or not. You say whatever you want. <laughs> and I said, it's a deal. And, um, and I was very and grateful Johnny for had my a choreography. Solo. Yeah. Johnny, Johnny had a solo. Johnny had a solo. <laughs> it just, well, I, mean, I wouldn't call it a solo. I, nobody <laughs> else spun on their butt. No. It was pretty <laughs> It was, it was a shame. Uh, it's really all I could contribute. Uh, no, for the <laughs> well, you came to rehearsal and you were very sick. The last day. I think he thought it was just the most well, ridiculous Kaylee idea. kept coming to my room and saying, come on, you have to come down for flash mob rehearsal. I said, no, no, I have no, a life I don't. to live. I really, I, no, I don't. And, uh, <laughs> but I came down and I saw the last rehearsal and all of a sudden, after rolling my eyes for two weeks, I said, no, I really want to be a part yeah, of this. Yeah, it was so fun. <laughs> it was but I don't have time to learn the whole thing, so I'm just going to come in and, and do a backspin, which for, for good art, you know, I usually say for weddings. <laughs> <laughs> So that was my little contribution. It was I didn't want to be left out. Entirely. It was amazing watching the crew, oh, yeah. like Free 50 hearse. year old white males yeah. dropping it like it's hot. In the corners too. <laughs> it was so cute that night because it was the taping. So if you were kind of behind the scenes or near craft service or walking around, you saw someone back there going. Yes. Yeah. Everyone was trying to memorize their, <laughs> Secretly, their moves. Because it was supposed to be a surprise. Secretly. Melissa it's, and I it's, were practicing in my dressing room. I yes. kept saying, Melissa, I don't know it. Please come in yeah. and show me. <laughs> it's really actually touching for me to watch it. It's such a testament to how much we all, the crew in, in, included, just love spending time together. Yeah. I mean, in season six, to to give your lunches up to stay later after rehearsal for dance rehearsal for a flash mob. <laughs> you would think after six years, you'd be like, I'm out of here. I got family members. Everyone guys. stayed, and, by the way. Everyone on that crew, really, everyone's, it was just amazing. That's, real, that's evidence of, uh, of how incredible our workplace is. And now I can't. It's, it is, it's touching even to watch, even for that. It's on YouTube, y'all, but you guys are hilarious too. You're like, what? That was the going best part. We had no idea. Yeah. <laughs> You're no. like, wait, what, what? They've all lost their minds them funny, because they didn't know anything, right? And a little tidbit, because I love my sister. After the flash mob, Chuck loved her too, and she ended up choreographing for Two and a Half Men, that dance number that they yeah, did, we did in the we holiday did a, episode. We did a big dance uh, song number on Two and a Half Men called uh, You're a Big Fizzy Douche. <laughs> <laughs> it's Two and a Half Men. You know, that's, the, that's appropriate for that show. Mm -hmm. and, uh, and she killed it. She killed it. It was like 50 dancers, and she just... She, She's uh, a cool girl. Was awesome. She's an yeah. amazing, Very amazingly cool. talented woman. She was in the, in the clips that, yep, that we right. played earlier. She's the girl who says yes to the, the, re to the wedding episode. proposal. Yeah. Yeah. It's Kaylee's sister, Brie. Yeah. Oh, yeah. She's a very Aww. good girl. Yeah, oh, I know. Isn't that cute? That bitch stole Aww. my man. <laughs> <laughs>